September 21, 1989, is the most memorable day for a couple who worked at the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center. It's the day they gave birth to their son. And it's the day that shaped his whole life. I was born on September 21, 1989. By coincidence, China's manned space flight program is called 921 product, as it was approved on September 21, 1982. I feel very proud about this. Zhang Yang and the other kids who grew up at the center used to love watching the rockets blast off. And they never missed any of them. We got up at about 2 or 3 o'clock whenever there was a launch mission. Every time the launch was successful, everyone, including the engineers and their families, was so excited. Zhang Yang's role has quickly shifted from simply being an onlooker to actually working at the center. In 2012, he graduated from the Lanzhou University of Technology. He gave up the chance to work in Beijing. Instead, choosing to go back to Jiuquan. He is now in charge of maintaining the communication lines of the launch pad. Over the past four years, he has been awarded many times for his excellent performance in dozens of missions. Zhang attributed all his success to his parents, who have been working at the center since 1958. The first generation of aerospace engineers devoted their lives to developing China's two bombs and one satellite. They laid a solid foundation for us to try to build a space station. Our generation has been deeply influenced by the stories of the revolutionary martyrs who have gone through fire and water in the battlefield. That's a spirit of utter devotion. Zhang and his family are only one of thousands of people who have their roots at the Jiuquan Launch Center. For them, it's more than just a workplace. It's a place where they raise their family, as well as realizing their lifelong dreams of space exploration. Taoyuan, CCTV.